Hi, so today we'll look at how you can go about managing your stocks or inventory on TEG. In order to access the inventory section, there's an icon right on the left. The moment you click on that, you are in the inventory section. In order to add a new product, you can click on the icon here and say add product. You can fill in all the necessary information right from uploading an image, categorizing it as retail, consumable, or both. Define the category, the subcategory, the price, cost price, in, especially in case of a retail product. Also the measurements, the quantity that is in stock, a quantity which you want to call out as low quantity, SQA number, brand name, expiry date, and you can also add remark and description to it and go about saving it. So once this is done, the product gets added onto the system. You can anytime click on the product and make any necessary edits if required. Uh, it gives you a quick snapshot of the stock, how, how much, who issued it, the consumption, the stock history, and so on. Uh, now let's move on to the supplier part. Here is where you can add your suppliers. Again, fill in all the necessary information that is needed. Uh, there's no information which is mandatory. So whatever information is available, you can fill that and go about adding the supplier. Once the supplier is added, in case of any orders that have been received, you can also go about creating a payout right from here. Let's say in case of an order, if you want to create a new order, there's a tab right over here which says new order. When you do that, you can select the supplier from the drop down, put in all the necessary information, select the item that needs to be ordered or for, for which the order is being created. See if you need to add any additional expenses or charges to it and you can create it. So once the order is created, you can email it right from here to the supplier. You can export it onto an Excel. You can also mark it receive in case if you have received it, edit it and even cancel the order. So let's say in the case the order has been received. You can put in the necessary invoice number pertaining to that order, make any last minute changes and mark it as received. So now let's look at uh, in case of multiple outlets, how you can go about creating a transfer. In order to create a transfer, you can create, you can select the tab right from here, which says create transfer and choose the location that you want to make this transfer to. Again, similarly, by adding the items that are being transferred, you can go about creating the complete transfer. Then we have an interesting feature around auto consumption of stock. This is essential in case where you want to track uh, the quantity that's being used for a particular product within the outlet. In order to do so, you can select the service first, map the product with that service, define the quantity that gets utilized with each of that service and save it. So once this is done, every time an invoice is being generated for a hair highlight, a color highlight service, 10 ml of this particular product 
gets automatically consumed from your stock. Moving on, we have stock adjustments, wherein you can manually adjust your stocks, export it onto an Excel. If you want to make any bulk changes, you can do so and import it back onto the system and the, and the stock gets adjusted automatically. Then we have a complete stock ledger where you can either search by the product and check for the complete history. You can search by what has come in, what has gone out from the outlet. You can also select from the type of stock, whether it's a new stock, whether it has been returned, transferred, damaged, expired, and so on. And also created who has created it by the staff. In order to see the complete ledger for a particular tenure, you can also select the month that you want to look at. And it gives you a complete history of the stocks for that particular tenure. And all of this can also be exported onto an Excel. So that's it from my end in terms of the inventory section. Thank you and have a great day.